up, YouTube? Back at you with another, um, weird vi little video. Hold on, let me do something. Welcome back to another video here on the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can get Pocket Edition servers with Artinos. Stay tuned! showing you how you can get a Minecraft Pocket Edition servers with Artinos. Now if you guys do enjoy today's video though make sure to leave a like and let's uh, just get right into the video shall we? Alright so the first thing you're gonna do in it, the first thing you're gonna do is that I just turned off my phone. Whoops. Alright the first thing you do is of course you do need Pocket Edition so if you do have Pocket Edition there's a lot of people who have Pocket Edition because it's the, it's the prop the most popular Minecraft ever. So once you have Pocket Edition, first we're going to head over to the computer and show you everything. Then we're going to head over to the Pocket Edition and show you what you need to do. Alright, let's go. Alright guys, so what you're going to do, you're going to go over to Play. And uh, the server will be here. And then you're going to push uh, blah blah blah. You don't need to worry about that. But the first thing you're going to do is you're going to get over here and you're going to click one of these. Just one of these. You can mess around with them and see which one's better and whatnot. Alright, but you do have, to, if you're on a whitelist, you gotta whitelist the, um, the player name you wanna do. So, first you're gonna click start, um, I'll be right back when this is done. Okay guys, so it's done, uh, it's, it's right almost done. And then once it, it's done, you're gonna see this so, uh, called loading. And then it's gonna go past that saying starting, and it should pop up right now. Uh, uh, yeah, there it is, there it is, starting. I was looking at something else, so I pro you probably already knew it said starting. And then once it, once it after starts, it's going to do that, and you're going to do two now. Alright guys, I forgot to tell you that it does change if you don't uh, do the server, because I had to stop it for just a uh, just a second. Um, Alright, so what are you going to do? You're going to go over to your friends. So first, we're going to go create world. Now you got to hurry, because there's a timer on it if you don't do it right now. So it doesn't matter, so we're just going to... It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what the name is. And then what matters is that you got to do the IP. So you got to do... So let's do... It always changes. Um, okay, let's... Um, okay, let's hurry, 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 hurry. So it's always going to be at the end, uh, artinos.org. Artinos. Alright, <laughs> artinos.org. Uh, it can be worrying that you're not going to get in time. And then the port is, you got to look on your computer, it's 4798. One and then you're done and then add server and then all go all the way back to friends and then it should turn on the green light. There we go and then you go there and I just got whitelisted. Okay, so I fixed it. Um, I forgot to tell you on the computer. You, if you if you have it on like whitelist, it won't work. Okay, and then you can go inside and then all of a sudden you join in Pocket Edition. Yes. <laughs> That's how you do it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, that just about does it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed how to create a Minecraft PE server with Artino. So we can uh, stop the server for now. And you guys, thanks guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon. And if you guys want to learn more about Artinos, then please put it down below in the comic section. Thanks guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon. And remember, more to likes, more adventures. Lexon, keep on Minecrafting. Have a wonderful day. Lexon!